Welcome back, everybody. Derek Sue, your 2022 right in Oakland, Mayorio candidate. Well, today is an epic day, and it's a crossroads for a lot of different things. Number one, the rainy season has started. It, it's officially going to rain at least half an inch here uh, in the location of East Oakland where I'm at. So <laughs> I am thoroughly thankful and glad to be indoors and not outdoors at this time. Uh, uh, I went out earlier this morning, uh, about four this morning, to walk the dog. Uh, she had to go out and it was already uh, sprinkling. So, uh, uh, like I said, I am really thankful to be indoors where it's warm, it's dry. I don't have to worry about leaks or wind or, or anything like that. So, uh, that's been a real blessing. Number two, uh, today is one week from the November 8th election, the mid, <laughs> midterm elections as, as they're called. And, and so we have uh, a lot of things going on on the Oakland mayoral race. Uh, and hopefully you're keeping up with that. Uh, one person that I, I have not supported uh, um, throughout the entire race was Shang Tao, and now she's coming to light as being uh, um, a very chaotic type of person and, and not uh, what she uh, amps herself up to be. And, and so she's, she's in hot water right now with uh, an uh, an investigation is underway uh, with uh, Shang Tao. Uh, and so uh, we'll see how that, that affects the mayor's race. But next week, November 8th, be sure to uh, either get your ballots in the mail or drop them off at a location. I'm going to be uh, going to my uh, voting uh, location here uh, instead of well, number one, my, my mail-in ballot didn't show up. And, and that's an issue because uh, here in East Oakland, a uh, lot of uh, mail carriers, there aren't enough mail carriers and they're not getting the mail delivered here in East Oakland. And this is one of those neighborhoods uh, where we have that mail problem uh, that I posted about. And so uh, rather than uh, uh, having to worry about my ballot, I'm going to be going to my voting uh, um, location, which is not that far away. It's a uh, walking distance, so I'll be voting there next Tuesday. And again, I am the right-in candidate for protesting the status quo here in Oakland. Uh, I have uh, talked about my resolutions and solutions for uh, reducing and uh, getting a, a good firm grip of the criminals and the crimes being perpetrated here in Oakland. I also have a plan for the homeless, which is uh, long-term housing is included in that. And so uh, there's a lot of great solutions. Also, I plan on bringing three new um, uh, destination attractions to Oakland. Also, we're, we're talking about supporting a new soccer team here in Oakland, uh, along with uh, uh, still continuing to land a WNBA uh, women's basketball team, pro team here in the Oakland arena. And so there are a lot of things that uh, we're working on that, that uh, I support. Uh, and, and so right now the A's aren't as uh, big a, a deal because right now, uh, the news is, is that they're going to be leaving anyway. They announced that uh, just this past weekend, and if you go back to a couple of uh, my videos, uh, I also posted that uh, through from Zinni 62 Media, and it talks. We were Zinni was the first one to get that uh, information out. I posted it directly. It's been nearly two days since uh, that announcement that now the regular media has just picked that up. The same thing with the Shang Tao issue. You know, they're about two days behind also. So anyway, a lot of things happening. Also, 
uh, today is the third three weeks since I was burned out by an arsonist and three weeks since I contacted the city of Oakland specifically Lenita Hogue who is a city uh, of Oakland caseworker in the homeless uh, sec um, department and so she's the person that that I contacted uh, and, and I she also mentioned that they are working up very hard on Wood Street getting those folks into housing first so I understand that but it's been three weeks since I've I've not heard a thing from Lenita or the city and so that creates a problem if uh, there are other folks that are victims of, of arson like myself and there are many here in Oakland that become victims for one reason or another and, and the city should be stepping up much quicker than than what they're doing they should have had me had an answer back to me within 72 hours but no uh, Lenita had asked for uh, till Friday of that week and she would get back to me and she has not and so that creates a, a problem there so these are all milestones right now uh, I'm okay uh, where I'm at and, and the, the temporary housing that that uh, has been offered them that I've accepted and so these are all milestones and I want you folks to know you know things have changed with if you vote for me and elect me your next Oakland mayor this madness that's been going on in Oakland for eight years plus ends. It ends. And so thanks for joining me today. We'll be right back.